How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. I better stop filming because I'm gonna wreck us. Can you, there you go. What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, me and Zach, he's the man holding the camera right now. But we got the Pelican behind us. And we're going up to a little lake, extremely small lake. And uh, we are going to try to catch some crappie. Now we're also probably gonna do some bass fishing as well, but kind of the main target today is crappie. And I know this lake has some pretty good crappie in them. And hopefully, I've never had a wintertime crappie. Have you used that? No. And they say winter winter fish just taste better. So I plan to put that theory to the test. That's kind of the plan for today. Yeah. Uh, I want the number seven, share a meal. Now how, how did we get to 15, 14 out of 12, 19? I don't know. What happened there? Good night, fish costs $3 for cheese. I'm taking that off. Yeah. Right, thank you. You too. Well guys, we made it, and uh, now we just gotta get all the stuff in the boat, and uh, let's get out here on the water. Let you guys look out here, the wind's blowing pretty good. It's kind of what it's looking like, if you can tell anything about it. It's kind of the, it's what we're working with here, and we'll set you back down. And uh, go ahead and get the boat ready. We'll get in the water here in just a sec. This is kind of the setup for the Pelican. We've got the big battery back here, camera gear. Of course, I'm going to tuck that over there. 30 pound thrust trolling motor. And that's kind of how it looks. We've got the minnows. I'm going to put you guys probably up there. Guys, let's get out here and see if we can uh, catch, some, catch some crappie. Of course, we'll do a little bit of bass fishing too. I'm starting to feel those white castles. That was not a good idea. <laughs> but let's get to it. I'm literally dying at Zach right now. <laughs> He's a little shaky on that pelican. <laughs> Give us a little push. There you go. Now. <laughs> I think we're moving. Yeah, we're moving. We're moving now. We're good shape. I know, guys, it's been raining quite a bit, and uh, the water is pretty, pretty muddy right now because of all that rain. So the fish, the fish probably be up a little bit more shallow than, than usual. There's no lake maps or anything on this lake. It's very small and we don't have a fish finder first we got a we got some riprap over here at the dam so we're gonna go hit that and uh actually just got one gopro battery so that kind of stinks but we're just gonna roll with it you guys stay tuned hopefully we can get some fish in the boat boy she's cold out here we're just kind of roaming around the lake mostly getting hung up and stuff or zach zach's getting hung Zach's getting hung up. So the water's really muddy. Probably not ideal for catching crappie. This wind is terrible out here. It's probably some of the worst winds I've fished in in a long time. We're in a little pelican boat, so that's that's always fun. Breeze got pretty hard. I'd much rather be on the lake. Oh! Oh! Oh, look at that, baby! Yes, and I'm recording, boys. Son, that is a ghost. Hold on, don't turn him loose. Don't turn him loose, because that might be all we get. <laughs> boys, would you look at that? Yeah, We've been fishing that. for a long time. Let me see what it feels like. Let me see what it feels like. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look how pale that thing is. That thing wild. That's a pale bass, boys. Go ahead and give him a real graceful, hey, graceful you know. release. Go back and tell your friends. As soon as the bait goes down the water, it's, it disappears. Can't see it. Pretty much what has to happen is you kind of have to throw it right on their head. And uh, where'd you catch him at? Right out in the middle. Right out in the middle of the lake. So that didn't really help much. I don't care how small it is. I just want to catch some. So let's keep fishing. One eternity later. Well, guys, we got the boat loaded up. It's, uh, man, it's just been rough out there. Crappie fishing was definitely a no-go. So... I guess we'll catch you guys on a different day. So guys, it is a new day. The sun is bright, but the weather is nice. And uh, well, it's about 55 degrees. So today, we're gonna go down and try to finish this video up at uh, Zach's Pond there. He actually got a new boat. He actually got a Coleman boat, which is very similar to the Pelican that I have and that we went in right then at the beginning of the video. So guys, we're gonna go ahead and go down to his house and try to get on that Coleman and see how we do, see how it compares to the Pelican. Maybe kind of give you guys a little bit of a 
review on it quick one well guys we've arrived uh zach's actually already out there if you can see him where's he at there he is him and him and someone else is actually on the on the little coleman which is fine because I, I don't care to fish from the bank you liking that thing looks pretty good but anyway guys here's the current situation bluebird skies for the most part and 55 degree weather and water looks okay looks about the not the same as it usually does so but here's what we brought today well actually i actually brought you guys see this one all the time this is just a must have got a little swim bait tied on there a little corrado and the dobbins well i don't break it and the first time i've used this thing Got a little quarter ounce Texas rig on there, something like Corrado K and an X Pride. You guys really haven't seen that yet. Kind of, that's the only two I brought today. So I think I'm gonna be throwing that little swim bait around. This water is pretty clear, and probably just be flipping a little small Texas rig. Like I said, I just got a quarter ounce on there. This pond, really, most ponds have a really soft bottom. You don't wanna get too heavy on that. So that's kind of the plan. I'm gonna switch you guys over to the GoPro, and that's probably what I'm gonna use for the most part. Put the big camera in the car, and we'll get to fishing, guys. Stay tuned. Just throwing a little vile bug on there. It's a great little bait. Hook might be a little bit too big. Nah, perfect. So, that's kind of what we're dealing with. Might pitch that around a little bit. Start out with a little swim bait to see if we can find some active fish. Huh. That looks like a pelican. It does, does. I believe it is. But, uh... So guys, we might have told you wrong. So, originally, he thought that this was a pelican or a Coleman. That's what the guy told you, right? And that's what he sold it to you as. But actually, it's got a Coleman and a pelican sticker on it. So, and I mean, it looks identical to my pelican. What do you think? Yeah. I mean, it's identical, just a different color, maybe a little bit older. Yeah. But there's absolutely nothing wrong with it. Great little setup there. He liked mine so much that he had to have one himself. So, I think that's going to be perfect, especially with this little pond right here. Maybe that Coleman pelican challenge may not be happening after all because i'm pretty sure that's pelican you guys let me know down below because i've never rode in a cold one before so there you go oh man my legs are hurting i went to the gym yesterday man this thing is nice yeah i wish i'd have brought me like a spin oh there's fish Oh, that was decent. That was decent when I didn't reel down to him. So guys, that's it for today. Uh, thanks so much for watching. I think this is the first video. Actually, no, you guys did see a fish catch, so. I've never, I don't think I've ever posted a fishing video where we were actually fishing and not caught a fish. So, but I think we did catch a fish. Maybe not me, but I think Zach did. In my last video, I was thanking y'all for 400, but now we're almost a third of the way to 500. So let's go ahead and get that done. Get, a good, get off to a good start to the new year. But anyway, y'all, it's been some tough fishing. Sometimes that's just reality. That's how it is. But anyway, guys, be sure to subscribe, comment, like, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time on another episode of Fish One Tape.